Learning more tonight about an effort to keep students from one local university from going hungry as they struggle to pay for their education. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen is live in the newsroom now with the new details. Shane and I met with two student leaders today and they say that there's a need on campus and they say they're doing what they can to try to feed students. At the University of Massachusetts Dartmouth, students bundle up Friday as they go from their residence hall to class. It's no surprise, education is expensive. Not just here, but in universities across the country. So expensive, some students are unable to afford food after buying books and paying tuition. They bring it on campus. UMass Dartmouth seniors Aubrey Brault and Samantha Smith told me when they learned that classmates were struggling to eat, they had to step up. They were cutting corners. It was uh, classes instead of food. and. Um, that should not be the case in college. I mean, we're all cash strapped, but the fact that if, if food should be basic, right? That's not an exception. Yeah, students should be trying to choose between buying books and paying for classes and being able to eat every day. They secured space for a food pantry at Dartmouth Bible Church. It's just a block or two off campus. Appliances, space. They're now trying to get the word out that students don't have to go without food. They'll open it up on December 3rd to see how it goes before permanently opening the doors next semester. Ralt and Smith aren't sure how how many students are in need of food, but say even if it's just one or two, all the work will be worth it. And they're both very appreciative of being able to use that space at Dartmouth Bible Church, but they say their long-term goal is to open a food pantry on campus. Live in the newsroom, Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.